fast forward thinking Would you rewind and let us in I'll be ready where the pieces fall I'd like to welcome each of you to this celebration today as we watch Jesus join Casey and Alexa together in marriage. Alexa, today will be a day we will always remember, a staple in our relationship. I pray that we enjoy every step, every picture, every moment. I love you so much. Your hubby, Casey. Holy moly. Today is the day. I cannot wait for our first look and for us to see each other. And I pray, I pray you are the one whom my soul genuinely loves. You are my everything, my best friend. You are so loved. Enjoy these cufflinks. I can't wait to hand them down to our son. I love you. Love, Miss Kearns. <laughs> Very sweet. Mm. Oh, that's so cool.
Alexa Brook, you have been my best friend, my mentor, my playmate, and most importantly, my safe space. You are exactly what I need in this life, and I pray that I can always be what you need. We're standing here in front of all of our friends and family as I confess my love for you. Why me? Why do I get to take the hand of the most beautiful woman in the world? Because I am worth it. <clears throat> as you remind me every day, as I struggle with self-confidence and self-worth, you make me feel so good about myself. When I am feeling alone, you drop everything to be there for me. You are my number one fan, supportive in all the good that I do, but also quick to call me out on all the bad. You hold me accountable and to a high standard. Your loyalty to me has meant so much through days of anxiety, depression, and anger. You have, had, you have been such a safe space for me. You have made me feel comfort in being vulnerable, something I've always struggled with. And I've never cried with a woman until I met you. And what an amazing thing that is. As we grow through life's hardest and happiest moments, I promise to love you without reservation and expectations. I promise to laugh and smile with you. And I promise to never let me or you go to bed angry. I promise to give you comfort in times of sorrow and grief. And I promise to always listen to your thoughts and feelings. I promise to love you through the worst and the best times. I promise to admire your huge, strong, kind, and determined heart. I promise to create a household and raise our children as a team and equals. You are my better half, my soulmate, my best friend. These are promises I'm making to you today, and I will wholeheartedly do my absolute best to stay faithful and honor all of these promises I make to you today. Casey Allen Hearns, I knew you were the one when I realized that you truly are a better person than me. You are so blessed with a huge heart that I know not many people get to see. I am blessed to see that huge heart every day, each and every day. If anyone would have told me four years ago that we would be getting married, it would have been a hard thing to believe. This was all God's timing. He separated us so we could grow individually before growing together. Over the past two years, we have built the foundation of a godly, loving relationship that I know will stand up to the test of time. First, I vow to continue the little things, staying up too late binge watching TV, vegging out all day on the weekend, <laughs> our funny faces, jokes, and sayings that really no one else knows about. I also vow that you will never feel like you are second best. I vow to encourage you to be the very best you can be. I vow to always stand up for you when obstacles come our way. Mm -hmm. I vow to always put God first in our marriage and family. I vow to stick by you, to fight for you, and always comfort you. I vow to always be your best friend and sacred confidant. These are my sacred vows to you and I will love you from this moment until my last. My Bubba boy, stepping in and stepping up in your life has been a journey for both of us. You have given me the privilege of being your mommy, and I am so proud to be your mommy. You are wild, free, and smart and handsome. I have loved your daddy for many years, and I have had the honor to love you for almost the same time. I vow to protect you. I vow to always make decisions in your best interest. I vow to love you unconditionally and to always love your daddy. I vow to always Pray with you, pray with you, and tuck you in at night for as long as you let, as, for as long as you let me. I vow to listen when you need to be heard, to wipe away your tears, and guide you in this life. I love you with all my heart, my son. Aww. And according to the laws of the state of California, you are now husband and wife in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. As Jesus said, so they are no longer two but one flesh. I know it's killing you. <laughs> Wherever, therefore, God has joined together, let no man separate. Casey, you may kiss your brother.
got this feeling like it's starting now, starting now. I feel adventurous with you. And there is nothing that can hold us back, hold us back. We can do what we want to do. Cause we got all the time in the world for better or worse. We should stay together. So let's stay young and in love. We should focus on us forever. Yeah, baby, if you feeling like I do, we can run away across the ocean. Baby, what you say? We can leave today. Anywhere we'll go, we'll be alright. It's all about you. I'm a sister. I can't believe I ever accepted a man in your life. You know, I, I ran a bunch of men off. Chased him up our street and everything else. Just uh, keep on doing what you're doing, and 
I can't wait to, you know, more nieces and nephews and all over. <laughs> Casey and Alexa grow as individuals and as a beautiful couple. They both do the work to better themselves and each other. Alexa not only loves Casey with all her heart, but little Casey as well. Uh, she has stepped into a mom role, which I'm very proud of her for, for doing, but she could not have done that without the support of Casey. It is very clear how much they love each other. They both are off the wall nuts. <laughs> One more than the other. I won't go into detail. Uh, um, but not only did they find each other again, but most importantly, they found someone to stay a child at heart with. And um, let me tell you, they are they act pretty childish all the time. <laughs> I'm like, what is, what's going on here? But I couldn't be more proud of the both of them and the people they are becoming and have yet to become. I am happy they have found the forever person. So with that being said, please, congratulations to Alexa and Casey. May God bless this happy marriage and a beautiful life.